Hi again, uh, welcome to my channel. Uh, thank you for taking the time to check me out again. Um, right now, um, I'm on holiday for a well deserved break in the Netherlands. Now, what I did, I brought along my uh, one of my latest acquisitions. Well, not latest, I had it some time, and my daughter told, told me about it. Um, she said, Go down to uh, cash converters in Medway and check out Gibson. I thought, okay. <laughs> I got there. I didn't know what to expect. I opened the case and this bright orange thing uh, confronted me. I thought, oh my day, what? Um, had a closer look at it and what it is. It's a Gibson uh, 60 tribute made in 2013. It's a mahogany body, maple, maple cap. Um, it's got the basics uh, three-way selector switch switchcraft. It's got uh, Gibson burst buckers one in the neck position and burst buckers two in the bridge position. And it's all the known normal appointments with two tones, two volumes. But it's been refinished. Um, and I literally haggled uh, with them and basically they dropped the price down to from 700 to 500 pounds. I said, look, this has been refinished, so it's devalued. But having said that, the burst buckers, get a set of burst buckers, you're talking about a few hundred pounds, the case is another couple hundred pounds. So if you work that out, um, just the parts alone, it's worth it, okay? So it's allowed me to get an authentic Gibson uh, USA made guitar, but it's refinished. It's got some blemishes on it and stuff like that. I'll probably do, um, complete strip down the review it's got locking tune nuts locking tunes on it okay um, so it's well equipped you know rosewood fingerboard medium jumbo frets it's got a, a slim a slim a seat profile neck on it um, overall the, the bones of it is pretty good a bit bashed up but it's okay okay so I'm just going to give it a test run um, um, just to try it out, see how it sounds. I've got no effects and all that. I just pull along my Roland Cube amplifier, um, which is operated by batteries. There's no effects on it, it's basically clean, but let's see what happens.
Okay, that's okay. It'd be interesting to see how it goes through my uh, one of my favourite amps, the Fender Blues Junior 15 valve amp with all the effects and stuff like that. But you know, when I come back from my holiday, um, I'll give it a, a proper review. Um, for now, try for now. Stay safe. Stay strong. Rock on. <sighs>